Sunday afternoon at a Starbucks in San Diego, 19 year old barista Alex Beckham says the customer in blue pulled down her Trump 2020 mask to ask a question. Beckham says she asked the customer to put the mask back on, which she did before becoming agitated and taking it off again. That's when another customer says he started recording. I told her that just to make sure that when she comes, if she ever were to come back, to make sure that the store and the customers were protected. Moments later, the customer serves up a different motive. No, it's because you're discriminating against me because I'm a Trump supporter. Sure. Black Lives Matter. If she felt discriminated against because she was a Trump supporter, that's on her. That's not my fault. I never brought any mention of her politics. Moments later, the customer becomes more upset. <laughs> It's not a law. It's not a law. And I can show you the penal code and everything. It's a hoax. I don't have to wear a mask. I'm not going to wear a mask. This is America, and I don't have to do what you say. Trump 2020. You need to leave. Thank you. No. Thank you. Have a good one. The customer isn't quite done yet. Black Lives Matter. In Beckham's words, this is her first, quote, crazy Karen experience in three years as a barista, but she says she isn't surprised. I'm from a place that's really conservative, and I've been racially targeted uh, my whole life here, so it's kind of like a normal. But Beckham says this incident is not okay. She posted it on social media, and it went viral, some two million views in a day. I feel like it's really important to show people that this sort of behavior should not be normalized and should not be acceptable. All right, well, the barista says store managers have banned that customer from returning to the store. She also says a woman who was with that customer was apologetic and almost in tears because of this encounter. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm John Muller. Back to you guys. And that's why there's always a camera rolling somewhere to catch yeah. the full story.